Kia ora team, Chris Fahey here. Today we're checking out the latest real estate action on Hobson Street and in central Auckland. This vlog starts at the bottom of Hobson Street with the downtown car park. Auckland Council's regeneration arm has been planning the potential sale of this property for redevelopment. Panuku recently announced that potential development partners will need to respond to how several transport requirements could be integrated into the redevelopment. They are a bus facility, multimodal transport hub, and no particular specification on the number of public short-stay car parks. These outcomes will sit alongside a range of urban development outcomes that were previously announced. Panuku has indicated that they'll start a competitive process for this opportunity in July. Meanwhile, at the corner of Wyndham and Hobson, the ground floor lobby for Chorus House was recently refreshed by its owners. Projects like this can be quite complex, but can add real value to larger buildings by improving the amenities for office workers that use the building. Further up the road, work continues on the New Zealand International Convention Centre. You'll probably recall that this was damaged midway through construction after a massive fire broke out on the roof during October 2019. Sky City announced during February 2021 that the completion was targeted for the end of 2023, and as you can see, they've got workers going hard on the site at the moment. Finally, near the top of Hobson Street, the Scaffold Wrap was recently opened on Auckland City Mission's home ground development. Home ground features 80 apartments alongside spaces to provide services to the community. An interesting fact about this building is that on completion, it will be the tallest cross-laminated timber building in New Zealand, and so completion is expected later in 2021. So I hope you enjoyed this quick update of the latest real estate action on Hobson Street in central Auckland. If one of your mates is working on these projects, then please tag them in the comments. Or if you just thought this video was cool, then go ahead, smash that like button. Cheers, bye.